Hey everybody, this is Tim Coach with Adonis Detail. I've been in the rap business for over a decade now. I started my business back in 2010. And one common question we get is, how much does a wrap cost for my vehicle? So I wanna do a quick video discussing the differences between a vinyl wrap and a paint protection film wrap. What you can expect with both technologies, some downsides and some upsides of both, as well as the cost of each. All right, so vinyl wraps are what you may notice as a color change wrap. If you notice a car out there that's like a pink or a neon yellow or a satin color, oftentimes they're a vinyl wrap. Now vinyl is made from PVC, it's a form of plastic. And as you can see, you can get vinyl in basically any color or any finish. Um, there we got metallic colors, we got bright colors, oranges, satin finishes, you even have carbon fiber finishes. So basically the sky is the limit with vinyl wraps in terms of the color you look uh, or look you want for your vehicle. So you can use your imagination. So this is not gonna protect your vehicle. This is just gonna be basically change the look of your car. So if you wanna have, a, say, the white car or a black car, or you wanna change it to a red car, a vinyl wrap's gonna be the way to go. The downside of this is that typically these wraps will last only a couple years and you're not gonna get the protection that you get out of a protective film or a clear bra. And you look at cost-wise for a vinyl wrap, it's gonna vary depending on your location, also depending on what type of material you're gonna use. Your more basic colors, let's say your, your whites, blacks, um, your typical colors that are a gloss film, you're looking at anywhere from $1,500 to about $3,500 for a full vinyl wrap. If you're doing a specialty film, that's like a satin finish, a brushed gunmetal finish, a metallic finish, those are gonna be a little bit more expensive, anywhere from $2,500 up to about $5,500. So vinyl wraps, like I said, gonna change the look of your car, not gonna give you much protection, but give you a really unique look. Last anywhere from a year to three to four years, depending on how well you maintain it. We obviously do recommend considering a ceramic coating or using some car care related products to maintain your vinyl wrap to prolong that durability. So clear bra is also known as PPF or paint protection film. There's some other firm, uh, words out there to describe it. The main goal of this stuff is gonna protect your car. So it's a clear urethane based film. So a TPU based versus a PVC based of the vinyl. Comes in big rolls like this. Uh, it is a clear film that has a backing. So as an installer here, we got big rolls, we pull it off the film uh, and apply it to your car. A good clear bro install, you're not gonna notice anything's done to your vehicle because it is a clear film. The goal of this compared to the, the PVC based vinyl film is paint protection. So unlike your vinyl films, this is gonna give you protection against rock chips, protection against scratches, um, even minor fender benders. This will protect the film or protect your paint uh, very well. It's eight mils thick, versus your vinyl film is two to three mils thick. So it's almost you know, three to four times the thickness. So this is PPF, also known as Clear Bra. It is a clear urethane based film. It has a clear film on top with a clear coating and an adhesive backing. So this is what's installed on top of your painted finish. This is what gives you the protection. It is a slightly flexible film. So it's gonna contour to the, to the surface of your vehicle, but it is thick, about the thickness of a credit card, which gives you that rock chip and scratch protection. So it's gonna be very tough stuff. You can see it's a tough material that can conform to the look of your vehicle and give you that protection without changing the finish. Oftentimes too, this material is gonna give you actually a better looking vehicle in the long run since it is hydrophobic and it is self uh, healing in terms of the scratch resistance on it. Basically, we look at a change to look at your car, vinyl is the way to go if you're looking for protection. PPF is the way to go. But now, now that technology has been evolving, they actually have satin versions of this clear film, as well as some colored versions of the TPU-based PPF. So that also gives the option of both protection as well as unique look for the vehicle. Now to talk about cost. So your cost of the, uh, of the P, uh, PPF install is gonna vary depending on your size of your vehicle, depending on the scope of your work. Uh, sometimes you can wrap just the front bumper of your vehicle, just the headlights or some more you know, damage prone areas. Unlike the vinyl wrap where you have to wrap the whole car, you can piece together a package with this stuff, uh, depending on your budget, depending on what you're looking for. Oftentimes, you know, in my career, we do a lot of full front ends. You're typically looking at anywhere from $1,500 to $2,500 for the front end of your vehicle. And oftentimes now, what I do recommend is wrapping the full vehicle. Now that new cars are becoming more expensive to do body shop repairs, and they're also more prone to damage, they're gonna pay dividends throughout the whole car versus leaving some panels uncovered. And that can range anywhere from $5,500 up to $8,500, depending on, like I said, scope of the work, uh, type of vehicle, as well as what type of film and material you go with. So 
There's a couple different installs with this. You can use a pre-cut template or a custom install to wrap a little bit more edges and use some more seams. Typically the custom installs would be a little bit more expensive to weld too. So like I said, the trade-off is paint protection. This will last up to 10 years, give you the protection against scratches and rock chips. Uh, also can change the look of your car if you want to do a satin finish uh, or actually also change the color of your vehicle. They now have tinted or color TPU based films. So just want to go over those two options for you guys. We've been doing this for well over a decade and work with both materials. They both give you different attributes um, as well as the, the, a unique look depending on what you're looking for. So pricing will vary. If you have any questions, we're happy to answer them too. So leave a comment below. Make sure you subscribe for more videos like this as well. We're going to talk about many car care related and paint protection related topics in the future. So make sure you subscribe to us. And I do thank you for watching and stay tuned for the next video.